Howdy everyone! So today I want to talk about how to shatter procrastination and what exactly is procrastination? Basically it's pain, but wait a minute, let me explain. Every time that we want to grab a new book, start a new business, losing some weight or even do the dishes, our subconscious mind connects it into pain. Uh, for example, when I was a kid, I weighed around 120 kilos, it's 250 pounds if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it was a really large dude. And every time that I went to a new nutrition, started a new exercise, I thought that I'm really falling through and really going with my diet. And at the end result, I saw that I gained weight instead of losing weight. And I started to ask myself, what the fuck is going on? Why I don't lose weight? And until it hit me that basically what's stopping me from losing weight, because every time that I fought on dieting, I thought about dying. If you think about it for a second, when you separate the word diet, it's creating die. And I really felt like I'm dying because I don't eat the food that I like like eating ice cream, chocolates, cakes, everything that you imagine. And it really felt like shit until I put it on a scale. What is more painful? To stay in that situation, staying a really large dude and still eating all the things that I like but then I thought to myself, against that, the pain of not falling through, in five to ten years, what, what will happen? I will still stay fat, or even I will gain more weight and be more uh, fat. And maybe I will develop diseases, and I will stay with low energy, and I will stay with in I and I will stay insecure and all that against not eating the food that I like that pain was a really really massive pain and I told to myself I, I want to suffer not eating the food that I like instead of feeling that way for good and I start to fall through, I start to lose weight, I got to around 75 kilos and I start to feel great. I start to feel better, with more energy, alive and really start to live and finally even get more, feeling more secure with myself. And I think that was the most important part to put the things on a scale. What is more painful? Stay in that situation on, or do the things that we want to do in order to succeed in our life. So what I did is, is really take, th take that task and if you want to and it will really help you to develop a new lifestyle. Take a, a pen and a paper, write two to four things that you really want to improve and put on a scale what is more painful, to stay in that situation and not following through? Yeah, you will gain more time, you will gain uh, maybe more food, for example, or if you follow through, the, what will be more greater? You will feel better with yourself. You will start seeing success. You will finally go the way you want to go. So what will be more great? What will be more pleasurable and less painful? When you put it on that scale, it will help you to increase pr productivity. And I hope you enjoy that. Uh, it was a long video, so thank you for watching. If you like it, just hit the like button, share it with your friends, help others, and be sure to subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.
And until then, have an amazing and productive day.